You're listening to the European Parliamentary Research Service podcast on ethics and technological developments. The relationship between ethics and new technologies has always been a complicated one. And as their impact on our lives increases, it's time to reconsider how new disruptive technologies can challenge established ethical norms and structures and how ethical and moral principles could be built into these systems. Stay with us. In a not so distant future, Self-driving cars might need to make decisions about the life and death of their passengers and others in case of unexpected events. Likewise, increasingly autonomous personal robots could loyally serve people but could also harm them. So the question is, how do we build ethical considerations into machines that are meant to play an increasing role in our lives? Actually, equipping machines with ethical principles and strengthening their moral potential for resolving ethical dilemmas has become a dominant technological trend. But programming a computer or a machine to be ethical is a complicated process, as acting ethically requires familiarity with moral principles and the ability to understand humans and their environment. The embedding of ethical values and moral judgment at the design phase of new technologies also raises questions about the moral status of these technologies. For example, will robots become morally valuable beyond their instrumental value and have moral duties and rights? Is it possible to construct some kind of artificial moral agents with moral knowledge? And if so, which moral code should they be programmed with? Such questions have led to the emergence of several initiatives, such as the Global Initiative on Ethics of Autonomous and Intelligent Systems and the Blockchain Ethical Design Framework, which aim at ensuring that social and ethical values are at the centre of technological developments. So what are the challenges for European policymakers? Well, considering that even the most powerful algorithms being used today haven't been optimised for any definition of fairness, EU legislators may have to consider the need for ethical standards to be built into algorithms that guide decisions on who can obtain a loan, an insurance policy, a job or a place in a school. European policymakers should also collaborate closely with technologists to investigate and prevent potential malicious uses of artificial intelligence. Complying with ethical standards has already become a legal requirement in many areas of EU law and the recently adopted European Parliament resolution on civil law rules on robotics puts forward a detailed process-based architecture for technology ethics in a rapidly evolving domain. One could see in all these initiatives the emergence of a new EU-wide social contract on responsible innovation, which could place ethics by design at the centre of technological development, but unpredictable as the sector is, we will always have to accept a degree of moral uncertainty when dealing with emerging technologies. You're listening to the European Parliamentary Research Service podcasts.